head. So he doesn't want to go this way. So guess what way we're going to work on? This way. Got a ring. Go straight. Ooh, this is gonna be good exercise for me. Just keep walking in circles. Definitely got an The reason why she did that is because when he got to the green gate, he turned right into the center. So her philosophy is work him where he wants to be, but he's still going to get worked. I can't tell what pause and resume is. Let's see. 42. There you go. Go ahead. Okay. If he ignores the leg, then maybe try just doing, if he doesn't want to go, just at a standstill, maybe circle him, circle and move his feet, try to encourage him to move, and then whenever he does, just reward him. Like how he's walking now, I'm going to alternate my leg squeezes, to he's one, to the other, ask him to pick it up, pick up his pace. Whenever he does respond to what you ask, that he did the right thing and release. As soon as he answers the question you ask him, release and give him that reward of releasing the pressure. Because horses learn from the release of pressure, not the pressure itself. Because you worked him. You know you're right. He's not even pulling anymore. And I'm right here. Usually he wants to come to me. I'm going to turn him around and see if that's where he wants to dart to when we switch direction. Okay, watch out, Dan. Oh. Good boy. 